Welcome to Healthy Delicious Cooking with Arlene. Today we will make a beef potato taco casserole. These are our ingredients and it will be listed on the description section below and I hope you will enjoy this video. First we will shred the potatoes We are using two large potatoes and if this is your first time please uh, consider subscribing and uh, if you like this video at the end please give it a like and please do share to uh, help others make healthy delicious meal. And after we shred the potatoes, we are going to shred the garlic also. And just be very careful shredding the garlic. I am being careful here. Just take our time. Sorry about that phone ringing, that was unexpected and we are just going to keep on shredding the rest of this garlic and uh, once it's done we're just going to clean the shredder and get all of the good stuff off of it. And now we are going to chop up the sweet peppers. And once it's done, we are going to um, add this to the potatoes and garlic. And I like the colorful ones here, yellow, orange, and red sweet peppers. And then we are going to prepare the onion. And we're just going to dice it. And by the way, thank you for joining me here again today. And I hope you will like this recipe and give it a try at home. It's really delicious. And once it's all done, we're going to add this with the other ingredients. And this is really easy. You just need one bowl and all you have to do is add and add every chopped up uh, ingredients that you have. Then we add the beef, round beef. And then we will add now the eggs. And now we're adding the taco seasoning mix. You can buy it at any grocery store. And we will add the cumin powder. And now we are going to add the black pepper and then the salt and once that's done we will add some Worcestershire sauce not much just a little and then we will add some olive oil this will keep it moist
and once it's all in the bowl we are going to just mix it really good until all, everything is mixed well together at this point you can also use your hands if you prefer doing that it'll probably be faster of course for the purpose of this video i am using the spatula so once everything is mixed together we are going to spray our uh, pan with a little oil and make sure that your oven is turned on and preheated at 350 degrees so now we're just going to transfer all these mixtures in the pan once again I just want to thank you for joining me here today and for watching this video and uh, I hope that when you do try this recipe at home that you would uh, let me know how, how, it, how it turns out for you and I hope you will really like it we are just pushing it down a little bit more and so that they kind of be uh, together when we uh, finally slice it once it's done and uh, then we will we, we are ready to bake this thing after we add the uh, cheese and just spread that cheese all over we are using cheddar cheese now we are going to put it in the oven and after a few minutes here it is looks very delicious thanks again for watching i hope you enjoyed this bye